Uh, he's probably from back here all the way to up here. <laughs> How many people would battle a 12-foot alligator with a handheld hook and rope in the swamp, in the dark, in a little boat not much bigger than the gator itself? Big gator is a big animal, big fight. <laughs> big, uh, uh, it's exciting. <laughs> Gator's chomping at you. The size of the head and jaw prove it. 26-year-old Bobby Whitehead says he and two buddies found the trophy of a lifetime, a 400-pounder, on the St. Johns River a few weeks ago during gator hunting season. He's 12 foot four. He's the biggest gator I've ever seen, ever seen in a wild, ever seen anybody catch. During the battle, the thrashing, spinning gator chomped holes in the boat and bit their harpoon in half. To legally bag a gator, you've got to get it close enough to the boat to kill it by actually making contact with it. They killed it with a bang stick, a pole that fires a bullet on contact, but that was only after a long fight. Yeah, if it wasn't for this hook, probably wouldn't have caught him. Bobby sold the meat for $35 a foot, that's 12 times 35, and he got an extra $150 for bringing in the biggest gator of the week. But he also brought back something else, his own body, still breathing and all in one piece. When they go gator hunting, I don't sleep. <laughs> he brought back another thing too. <laughs> a grin that won't go away. In Palm Bay, Dan Billow, West 2 News.